Welcome to the T-60 series of videos. In this video, we will briefly go over the changes to the datasheet equations for the TPS7H4001-SP when connecting multiple of them in parallel. The first change will be to the soft start equation. On the right, the soft start equation for a single device is shown. By simply multiplying the equation by n, which is the number of converters, the proper soft start capacitance can be found. The second change is to the enable resistor equations. Multiplying the currents by n, the number of converters allows one to properly calculate the resistors needed in order to set the proper UVLO. The last change is to the compensation resistors and capacitors. The resistor equation needs to have its GMPS and GMEA multiplied by the number of converters n. This means the equation needs to be divided by the number of converters squared. Note that both the C out in this equation and the following equations, as well as the I out and the RESR, are the total values from all the converters in parallel. For example, if one converter had one millifarad of output capacitance and there were four converters, it would be important to use four millifarads as the total output capacitance. Same as with I out. If each converter is expected to supply 18 amps and then there are four converters, then the I out in the equation would be 72 amps. This has been a quick overview of the changes to the datasheet equations in order to properly use them for paralleling multiple TPS7H4001-SPs.